to Louisiana Living. Welcome back. I'm here with Karen Laban with the Spice and Tea Exchange in West Monroe, and she's making a delicious dish, and she also brought some beautiful teas with her. Yes, so June is National Iced Tea Month. Okay. And what better way to celebrate National Iced Tea Month than with some iced tea? Yeah. Anything from our Southern Sweet Tea. Uh, we also have our Roy G. Biv, which is all the colors of the rainbow. Uh, so we're celebrating mm. color for the month of June as well. But it's super easy to make um, iced tea by just doing a simple cold brew. Mm -hmm. Anything that's quick and easy, you know, I'm all about that. Me too. Yeah. Me so too. It, that's why I brought this dish to talk about today is our coastal chicken kebabs. Mm -hmm. Because it's really simple. You can marinate it for an, half, uh, for an hour or you can marinate it overnight. Uh, and it's really just, you know, sprinkling the seasoning on there, adding some olive oil and putting it in a little Ziploc bag and then throwing it together on the grill or putting it in the oven if a grill's not convenient. Mm -hmm. So really super easy recipes for the summer. Um, you know, take it to the beach with you. That's a great idea. Yeah, if there's one seasoning that you take to the beach, take coastal seasoning. It has um, shallots and lemon verbena. It's mm -hmm. got some fresh um, lemon zest in there, some onion and garlic. It's what I call kind of a cooler um, seasoning, mm -hmm. but it's great on everything from chicken, fish, or pork. So it's really, it's that go-to seasoning for the summer. You could smell it down the hall. Yeah. It smells so good. <laughs> and then also the dips. Right, so the dip is made, that's just with coastal. So so it's sour okay. cream and then a tablespoon of coastal. You oh, can use it for easy. a chip dip, uh -huh. a vegetable dip. You can use it for um, your your kebabs, like using it as a dip for that. Mm -hmm. Super versatile. You can make um, whipped butter with it, season your butter, put that on bread. So coastal really is that summer like refreshing. I cannot wait to use it. And I'm going to give it a little taste. Okay, and while you're doing that, okay. I'm going to pour you some of this um, cold brew tea. Cold brew really is as simple as throwing the tea leaf into some kind of brewing vessel and then adding cold water. You're going to put it in the refrigerator like I just did mm -hmm. this one this morning and then all afternoon I can have um, iced tea. I love mine. <laughs> it is so easy. This is our white tropical tea, mm -hmm. um, pineapple and peaches. Thought about that for the peach fest coming up too. So, uh, just like a fun flavor, but you can also, it's really Cheers. fruity. Um, and then we can make simple syrup. So, if you like it sweet, you can add flavored simple syrups to it. Mm, it's so refreshing. Yeah, it's perfect. It's and the really coastal easy. chicken kebabs are so delicious. It's so easy because it just comes in this little pack and you can rub it on your chicken. Another thing, if you know, moms are busy in the summer, you don't really feel like cooking, mm -hmm. and then this is something great. Right, it's, I mean, like I said, it's really easy. I went to the farmer's market and picked up some eggplant. Mm -hmm. I like to just kind of keep a little marinade of something in the refrigerator, and you can just marinate something quick, uh, come home, you know, from work, throw that in the oven, or put it, uh, heat up the grill, throw it on the grill. It's like awesome. I said, it's super easy to take to the beach with you. We have these nice fused oils mm -hmm. um, oh, okay. that add flavor. So this leek. one has our leek, yeah. that's what's on there. And then also doing your iced tea. Uh, cold brew in your iced tea is one of the easiest ways. Mm -hmm. After dinner, throw your leaf in there, put some water in there, put it in the refrigerator, and you've got tea the next day. So All right. No fusses. Karen is located in West Monroe on downtown on Trenton Street. Go by and visit her. You will love everything she has. Thank you so much, Karen. Thanks for having me.